Hey guys, um, here is the inventory management system that we have developed and here we have a nice dashboard we have integrated high charts to our system and we can also export an excel or pdf file we have this section for product management uh, supplier management we can create a purchased order then here we can manage the different purchase orders and then also here we have the user management and we have also a permission roles and the scheduled requests something like that however this is built just using plain PHP so we are going to convert the code using Laravel framework and to install Laravel we need to have a composer downloaded into our uh, computer um, here is the instruction on how we can download composer in our device so you can just read it here and follow the instruction uh, I have already downloaded Composer in my PC and to validate you could run this command Composer uh, this will give you information about the downloaded Composer like version the options and the available commands so if you run Composer and didn't return any response you need to update your env file so just search for system and then here click this one edit environment variables and then click the this button environment variables here you need to look for the path and then click edit and then here as you can see on the second row this is the composer uh, installation you need to install the bin okay you click ok and then once you did that just run the composer and it should you should see these messages so we have now the composer next thing you need to do is we are going to create or install Laravel so here this is the command and then list um, I think it's there so I'm using Windows um, let's go to documents and then let's see the files so actually i'm going to use git bash instead of git i'm more i am more comfortable using it so here let's drag on the composer command so it's working um now i'm going to go to my documents folder then here i'm going to install the laravel project so the command that we're going to use is composer then here create project and then this is the laravel laravel and then the folder name of the project so let's call it inventory so let's hit enter and as you can see it is now creating the project and downloading the Laravel and the vendors so let's just wait for this to finish so usually it will take less than 
five minutes maybe four to five minutes to finish uh, downloading the entire Laravel project so as you can see it is already done so this one it is now generating the uh, optimized autoload file so it will take uh, three to four minutes so here you can also um, follow the instruction here once you have finished downloading the um, the Laravel files so let's just wait So here so now it's done and the application key is set already so we have finished downloading the files now the next step is we need to run the application so here we have to run the uh, before that we need to go to our inventory folder so as you can see we have that folder created and then let's serve or run this command as you can see the local development is starting and if you click as you can see we have loaded successfully the Laravel project in our uh, device so basically that's it for this video um so the next video i'm going to discuss um maybe we're going to just move this page first our home page and then also we have already a database for our php project so we have to create e migration files for these uh, tables and then also i'm going to discuss the basic like database configuration um, the routing uh, if you are familiar with models views and then the the controllers so yeah uh well, i'll be going to discuss that one in the next video thank you